Hi. 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 What's up, everybody? We just got back from the fit camp. It was pretty fun. This little gangster right here with her cool shades is gonna help me make some chicken. We're gonna show you guys how to make chicken. Uh, prepping it takes you like maybe five minutes to prep and uh, you just put it in the oven for about an hour at 375 and take it out and eat it. All right, so here we go. Be very careful with it. I can't. All right, so first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your olive oil and you're gonna line it in your pan and we're just gonna drizzle this around in the pan and we're doing this to make sure that our chicken doesn't stick to our glass. No. So we're gonna take our chicken. I like to kind of smear this around everywhere so the glass is all good. And then just start lining them up. Boom, good. Okay, now go get your step stool. We're gonna go ahead and uh, preheat our oven. We're gonna bake, and we're gonna put on 375. And hit start, and let that start preheating. We're gonna use this uh, garlic and onion spice blend. And we're just gonna put a lot of this on there. Um, we're using dark meat thighs, and we still, we kept the skin on. So we're gonna put a lot on here, because we're not gonna actually eat it. the skin, we're gonna use this skin as yep. flavor. All right, so we're just gonna put a lot on here, give it a nice flavor. So we got our seasoning on there, and um, like I said, we're gonna do a lot, some salt. My little helper here. And I don't think any salt's really coming out. No, we need different salt. Uh, we'll use the same one. All right, so we got our seasoning, and you can use any kind of seasoning you want. I just grabbed something that sounded good. Put some salt on there because that one didn't have salt in it. All right. And I always like to just go ahead and throw it in there even while it's preheating. Why not, right? Looks pretty good. All right. And we got Put our pepper too. Timer on. But we for don't look, we don't 60. Pepper. And so start. Alright, we'll be back. Boom. Alright. <clears throat> We're back. A whole hour later. Let's see what we got. Oh, yeah. That looks pretty good. That's it. That's all there is, really. Alright, so that's it. So you saw how easy it is to prep your meat. Um, a much easier way to, uh, or more time efficient at least, way to do that is to just grill your food. A big bonus to grilling is it'll probably take you, you know, 15 minutes to grill that food and <clears throat> it'll also just drip the fat right off of it um, if you're worried about that kind of thing. Uh, we, I use dark meat. It's higher in calorie because of the fat. So I'm going for more of a protein fat kind of balance with you know moderate carbs um, it kind of just depends on your goals and what your meal plan is but yeah that's basically it so and then you just you know boil some vegetables and uh, have some complex carbohydrates something like brown rice or if you uh, google low glycemic index foods you can find a lot of carbohydrates on that list that are really good for you to use when you're doing your meal prepping okay meal prepping takes you about two hours a week or if you're like me and you like to do it like midweek too, maybe three hours all right uh, once you get it down you start to it be, you start to get really efficient at it and <clears throat> you automatically notice the results from just having food prepared for you ready to roll at all times you're not gonna go searching for food and go to the store and buy extra junk. You're not gonna go to Jack in a Box and buy their junk because you got food already and it's already made and you're not gonna waste your money letting that food spoil while you go stuff your face with something really bad for yourself that's gonna sit inside your body. It's gonna take a long time to process. You wanna eat healthy foods, complex carbs, vegetables, fruits, and 
lean proteins. So if you have any questions, you could drop a comment in the box right there. Um, and I look forward to hearing from you guys. All right.